back, everybody. Uh, wedding week continues. Uh, Melissa Lamb has got some Pinteresting things for you. You've been to several weddings, including one very recently. <laughs> That's right. My sister actually had her wedding uh, just two weeks ago. So and it was in Jamaica, it right? It was. It was beautiful. Okay, well, let's start with this since we okay. got on that subject. Sounds because good. Because you guys were thinking ahead. That's right. Destination wedding is hard because you want to be able to, you know, tell your guests, get your guests thank you. So you want right. to be able to provide them with a favor. They're called little favors. Little right. favors. Right. But however, you're traveling. So you have, and we had so many, st so much stuff already. Yeah. You know, it's not quite possible to bring something with you. No. So what we did is we made these little tags before right. we left. Before you left. And that's all we had to bring. So CNR so, are the uh, who? CNR, Christy and Rich, and it right. has our name underneath. We had um, their date of their wedding, destination to grill Jamaica, and this is the little barcode of their actual date of the wedding. Oh, so is they're it? pretty cute. Nice. Yeah. This is all we had to bring. And then when we were there, jerk sauce is huge in Jamaica. It's kind of like their their they're thing. Their hot sauce, yeah. Exactly. So we went to one of the little stores, picked up a bunch of little jerk sauces, and then just made these just wrapped we were them there. at the top That's and put right. the tag on them. Exactly. And it maybe took us 10 minutes to do all of them. Isn't that awesome? It was super easy That's and good thinking. super cute. These People are. I really liked it. I like these little jars. These is little there jars. Tea? These are, this is tea and this is just from the dollar store. So you get two for $1.25. So do you really? If you're looking for a budget and you don't have a lot to spend, because favors can add up. A couple dollars here, a couple dollars there, depending on how many guests you have. Yeah. So yeah, I just found these little ones at the dollar store. I went to the bulk barn and found some loose tea. Yeah. And then, you know, you just pour in the tea. Yeah. And you can get different flavors depending, or different themes depending on what, you know, yeah. you want. And I mean, most people have loose tea now. They have the little, um, little tea bag to put it in. Or you could just, you know, throw it loosely in the water. It's gotcha. fine as well. Yeah. You close it up. I like the little jar too. The little jars, and you can put so many different things in here. You don't have to put tea. You can buy the ones with oil, which is also another popular one if you're maybe Italian or right. olive oil, you know, and add a little bit of rosemary in there. Right. Then you have like a rosemary olive oil. You can add so many different things. You can even, you know, put sugar, something sweet on your wedding day, things like that. Yeah, the jars come in handy for all kinds of things. Tons of different things. And you, you can, can use them creative. afterwards, obviously. Exactly. You can get creative and kind of, you know, come up with your own sort of take on what you want to give your guests. And did you find these at the dollar store too? <gasps> Those are for the dollar store as well. Three for dollar twenty-five. So that's another super budget-friendly wedding favor. So you potted a little plant. I potted a little plant. Now you can go, you know, to the market. They have tons of fresh flowers. Buy a big case. One pl f flower per. One little flower. You can, yeah. you know, add the ground, the earth, put the little flower in. And then all you want to do is add a little ribbon with a little thank you. And then you can leave them either at the front when you walk into the wedding reception or you right. can have them at everybody's table. And the table, yeah. And it adds a cute, you know, a little bit of color and a little yeah. flower at the table. Yeah. And again, where did you get these tags made? Um, actually, we had them made up. There was a... My sister's, I guess my brother-in-law now, yeah, yeah. his friend does the tag. He does so. that kind of work. Yeah. So you could even do that for whatever your little... Exactly. And right? I mean, there's so many companies that make these little things right now. You can make them on your computer really easily as That's well. That's another idea. You could do exactly. it yourself. You right? can do it yourself. Yeah, and make we them We just look knew authentic. someone who did them and yeah. did a great job. The, so. the reason being, I mean, if you're, if you're putting together a wedding and, and you know your sister just did it, it's yes. super expensive. Oh, so, it's crazy. So uh, the more money you can save, the better exactly. off you are. Exactly. And it, you know what, to me, Melissa, it adds a little personal touch to the it whole It does, thing. exactly. Right? And another great option, I've actually done this before as a wedding favor, is cookies. Very popular, you know, make up a couple cookies. Do you have any with cookies. you now? Unfortunately, I don't. <laughs> Didn't bring any. It was a winter theme, so I made a ton of snowflake cookies, icing them, just put a little cellophane and a little ribbon, and then they had them at the tables, and it looked really pretty. They were on the plate. What you're saying is you have no cookies with you now? I don't have any cookies with were me. Were you ever into gymnastics? Me? No, no, I wasn't. Figure skating was my Oh, that's forte. right. You were a figure skater. That's right. Uh, there's some cool uh, gymnastics going on down the street. I've right? been seeing them in studio. Yeah. They're pretty good. Yeah.